Good morning everybody, how are we all doing? It is Tuesday. Let's get into today's video. Hi everyone, so yeah, let's get on to today's video. Um I'm a bit I've been up really early and in fact I've been up most of the night because I've been worried uh before all that kind of a big favour but everyone can you please like this video, subscribe if you haven't already and press that notification bell. It helps with the algorithm and it helps push out my videos to other people. Anyway, so today I have <laughs> dropped my little baby. Millie Moo, off at the vets. <laughs> Where's your baby? <laughs> I did insert, a, I will insert a video, should I say, of her sat in the back seat of car, bless her. She didn't know what was going off until she got actually into the, um, the actual vets itself. Then she was like, mm -mm. She had to sit on my legs. She was sitting like a baby and looking at like head back and everything like oh. And then it came to going into the room with her and yeah, I started getting that. You know when you take your kids down to surgery and then they gas them. Oh, knock them, they put them to sleep for a bit till for the, I can't remember what you call it, anaesthetic kicks in and they start going like that. that is, that's the feeling you get that lump in your throat and you know, they're crying. Well, that's what I felt earlier, and plus they give her an inj in a, uh, injection in her backside, um, not in her backside, on her back end, you know what I mean? Uh, I was like, ah! <laughs> anyway, they give her that as a sedative to chill her out a little bit, and then when it, they put a co their collar on her and stuff like that, and it was time for me to go, and she was like, oh! She, she wasn't having any of it anyway so that's that now i'm going to be a nervous wreck waiting for the news that she's going to be okay and the sort of operation went well and if i haven't heard by five o'clock i've got to go up there so for five o'clock should i say did she say jeez brain fog is really bad today as well it's stuffy i've just been i've had to cut through my city center to get to where i need to be and it's all like one-way system now and it's like oh my god now I get confused with which lane I need to be in and then the building big roundabouts, that's a fourth exit and I, I, I scared silly. Let me know in the comments below everyone, Are you? what's the fear? If you drive, what is your fear? Mine is roundabouts and being in the wrong lane. Getting lost, <laughs> I'll just get the bus on that. But anyway, yeah, let me know in the comments below. I'm going to go and finish my cup of tea now and chill out a little bit and then I've got to wait my, my new products arriving today. I think it's my Vax carpet. It's not like it is a cleaner, but it's one of those and L ones that you can I can take to car and wash off seats. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I've got to wait a bit. It's been a few hours later, guys, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm tired. I'm tired and I'm just back in from the vet. Excuse the air, because it is absolutely peeing it down outside. And then the traffic were bad. Oh, look, get me started on the traffic. Anyhow, Millie's home. She's fine. She's feeling sorry for herself, which is understandable. She's just done a, some, an operation. She's had teeth, tea, five teeth removed, had a good clean, and she's got an infection in one of her toes where the claw is. So she's on antibiotics. But really, that's just fine. She's just on, the, on Hannah's bed at the minute. Just need to wipe her face a bit later on when she's... Obviously, chill down. She's got pain relief as well. So she'll have that tomorrow because she's had an injection just now. So, yeah. Oh, my Lord. PDSA. It was chock-a-block. I had one parking spot. took me forever to try and get in. And someone had kindly um, opened their door and left a scratch on it. Thank you very much. Whoever that was that uh, pulled in inside me. Obviously, someone had left. Open the door or someone's arrived. I can't, I won't be able to tell you. 
and instead of opening it slightly so I can get out, they didn't woof straight into my driver's door. Thank you. Does does that ever happen to you guys? Let me know in the comments because it's frustrating. The amount of times I've had to get repairs. One was in Asda. I think I, I, I vlogged that ages ago, where someone either left a trolley to roll along or the back of the car, which smashed the left hand side back of the uh, you know brake light thing. So I had to get a new casing for that. That was about ninety quid. Oh yeah. Oh, I've had a few scratches as well. So it's like, if that were me and I accidentally did that to someone's car, I'd leave them a note, give them my the details, and I'd pay for the repair. What is it wrong with people these days? I just don't give two hoots. And what's wrong with that piece of hair? Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave you leave because Hannah's made me a nice cup of tea and I am going to go and enjoy it. Yeah, we should go to a tea bag first. I just took out water and we got tea bag. <laughs> and also, I've got my Vax. Um, Carpet cleaner here, ready to see it properly. Ooh, ooh. Excuse that bit there, it's got my tarot cards in. But that is going to be used at some point. And I can't wait to use it. When it's a sunny day. And I can get the car in the car park and I can actually... Ooh, back seats. Anyway guys, thanks again for watching and I'll catch you with you in the next video. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And that notification bell. And I'll see you soon. Enjoy the remainder of your Tuesday. <laughs>